We begin tonight with the need for police officers all around Tampa Bay. There are many vacancies within local agencies, and now the governor is proposing a solution by hiring officers from up north who feel underappreciated and are possibly unvaccinated. Fox 13's Lloyd Sowers is live from Tampa Police Headquarters. So Lloyd, explain exactly what the governor is suggesting. Well, Linda, the governor says if officers from up north want to come here to work, Florida should pay them $5,000 bonus, whether they're vaccinated or not. Governor Ron DeSantis in southern Sarasota County saying Florida's economy is the best in the nation and renewing a pitch for northern police officers fed up with anti-police sentiment to come to Florida and get a $5,000 bonus. We're looking to capitalize off a lot of communities across our country who have turned their back on law enforcement. The governor denied reports that he's recruiting unvaccinated officers in particular, ones who might be losing their jobs in northern departments. It's for officers, period. It is, has nothing to do with their vaccination status, so that's just wrong. But he is against vaccine mandates for cops. I don't think a police officer should be fired over over shots. I don't think that that's correct. They've been out in the line. They've been out for for months, a year and a half, two years doing their job and we said that they were heroes for a while and now all of a sudden some jurisdictions want to fire them. I think that's wrong for sure. Northern recruiting began weeks ago. Lakeland police went to New York City where they hired new Lakeland police officer Matthew Spato. He said that you could park your police vehicles in front of your house and to me I thought that was mind-blowing. I used to have to lie about what I used to do. I used to have to tell people I was like a bartender because I was it was almost like I was ashamed to be a, a law enforcement officer. Of course, some of the governor's opponents say, look, uh, police officers are out there dealing with the public each and every day, coming in contact with uh, lots of people, and they should, in fact, be vaccinated. Tampa PD, one of the, the few large local departments under a vaccine mandate, like other city employees, they either have to have the vaccine or undergo regular testing. Linda? Lloyd Sowers reporting live for us. Thank you.